I have a wife, I have a girlfriend, and I still, from time to time, hook up with other girls. Following clips have been taken from Jubilee's middle ground video on alpha males and beta males. While I think those terms are so cringe and fucking stupid, I genuinely thought that this video was a well-rounded, honest conversation between a group of men. So I just want to comment on a couple of things. It's something I want to do. To not do it feels unnatural. Anything you engage in in life over a long period of time over and over again is going to start to feel natural to do. But to do something different or perhaps do the complete opposite of said action, that will feel uncomfortable because you're going against what you normally do. You might just want this one moment for a relationship. I can understand that. Sexually though, I think it's all BS. To you. I think a man can absolutely be head over heels in love with a woman and still sleep with other women and then not mean anything to him. If it means nothing to you to do it, why are you doing it? Create a fulfilling life. You should have purpose and meaning by every single action that you do. And just because it doesn't mean anything to you doesn't mean it doesn't mean something to someone else. And I think all men have the proclivity to want to sleep with other women. Do they though? Or is this a story you tell yourself to rationalize and justify what you're doing? A man should create choice in his life. Sure. And these are the choices for you. Being single, being in a relationship. Parameters of said relationship is entirely up to you and who you engage with. But really, those are your choices. It's the lying. It's actually the overall problem. When guys tend to go outside of a relationship, they lie to the woman. I agree with that. If everyone's upfront about their intentions and everybody involved knows what's going on, knows the parameters, everyone consents to what's happening, then go for it. The problem is you have guys who are monogamous, but they're monogamous because they're forced to be monogamous. No one's forcing them to be. It's unheard of to hear of a man being forced into a monogamous relationship. Can't really say the same about women though. They have no choice. They do have a choice. Stop trying to create a cop out and act like they're powerless. Also want to clarify, I'm talking about men who have the capacity to be able to attract a woman to get into a relationship and not men who are struggling with the ability to be able to attract a woman to get into a relationship. Because they don't have the skill to attract multiple women. Or perhaps they don't see the value in it like you do. They have the skills to attract the women that they like and they choose one and then they're satisfied. And a lot of times they'll use that as virtue signaling. I would never do such a thing. Well, actually, bro, you can't. Again, this is just another example of a potential cop-out. I can certainly agree with the sentiment that plenty of people who engage in virtue signaling often have poor character traits and usually are disingenuous. I'm sure all the women in relationships are thrilled to listen to this. Oh, the man I'm with is forced to be with me. It's not like he has a choice. I'm better at sex with women I care about. With my girlfriend or like my wife, sex would be great. With the other girls, it can still be good, but I know that I don't really put in that much effort because it's almost like I'm masturbating with someone. Again, I'm not saying that these guys can't engage in this behavior. The way they describe it, it doesn't sound like they even enjoy doing it. Why don't you just stick with having sex with your wife and your girlfriend if you enjoy that? Because evidently it has very little to do with sex. My friends would always try to encourage me to like hook up with girls that were on to me, but I wasn't really like into it. It made me feel like weird, like there was something wrong. And now I'm at a point in my life where I feel like I'm only having sex with multiple women, so I'm not weird, so I'm quote unquote normal. And this is what I take issue with a lot of this content is promoting an idea to men that this is how you need to be. And wanting to be in a monogamous relationship with a woman, that it's been forced upon you by our society and culture and you don't really have a choice and it goes against your innate nature and you're less of a man if you don't have lots of girls. And here's an example of a guy who went and pursued it because of the influence of other men who told him that that's what he had to do. It doesn't give me any gratification. I, I know in the back of my mind that like, I just like simply don't enjoy this. Everything he is describing is exactly how I felt when I used to do it. And being with one woman is just so peaceful. Telling young men that they are born this way and that they should feel this way, it can really not do damage, but just sort of make you second guess things about yourself. Am I normal? Am I weird? Is there something off about me? Everyone else around me is saying that I have to feel this way or I have to do these things, but yet I don't feel the courage to do those things. Remember what old mate said before? And I think all men have the proclivity to want to sleep with other women. And yet sitting across from him is a man admitting that he has the proclivities to not want to engage in this behavior. However you wish to engage in relationships with women, it should have no bearing on your manliness. Just choose what feels right for you and fuck what everyone else thinks.